Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with you guys a story that happened to me with The Real Real. Um, basically, I no longer shop at The Real Real and I wanted to share why I don't shop there anymore. So I do have receipts on everything that happened. This is not to reflect every experience at The Real Real, but this experience that I had was bad enough for me to not want to shop there anymore. So let's get right into it. So this all started when I wanted to buy my boyfriend a pair of Timberlands and I was just scrolling through the real reel and happened to spot a really good price pair of Timberlands in his size. So I decided that it was a really good deal and the pictures looked good so I thought I would just buy them for him. And then, so by the time it got to our house, it took like a few days, so, it, nothing seemed to be wrong at first. Um, he tried them on, they seemed good. But then I did notice at first there were some black tracks going around my house. But I didn't think anything of it, it seemed pretty minor. But then, a few days later, he decided he wanted to wear them out on the weekend. So then we left the house, and then as soon as we hit the concrete um, walking on the sidewalk, his shoes started to fall apart and it was very very strange i have pictures of what the shoe looked like and it was very very weird it was almost as if someone tried to fix the shoe and when they were gluing or uh sticking everything back together they didn't do it the proper way that's what it really seemed like because the shoe was falling apart and then by the time so like basically we started to go home because you it was really bad the entire heel was very messed up and it was on both of the shoes. So we went back home and then we were just shocked. We were just so shocked. So um, the following day I called the Real Real and told them what happened and they said that you could definitely return it. So then it was the weekend still so I decided to go immediately to the Real Real. It was a Sunday. We, Me and my boyfriend both went together um, to put the shoes or return the shoes to the real real. So when we returned it, we explained briefly what happened and they took the shoes, no questions. We didn't make a big deal out of it and neither did they. So basically they do give refunds. So I was waiting for my refund and then at some point I, I noticed that when I went back to my previous purchases on their website that I could click on the purchase of the shoes and I was pretty shocked at what I found. Basically, they were re trying to resell the same posting um, and I was just shocked because I would think that if it was a different pair of shoes, the the number, the SKUs or style number, whatever they want, whatever you want to call it, that's supposed to be changed and not only that, all of the pictures were the same as before and it was the, it was the price of the previous price but then it was marked down. So that basically told me that I feel like the real real doesn't inspect the shoes properly enough. And what could be worse is I was thinking maybe they don't they either don't take the, the they either don't take the photos again or they maybe they were the ones that tampered with the shoes um and re relisted them. It was really weird to me that the listing was the same listing that I could go back and click on it and the pictures were the same, the um, the description of the shoe was the same, um, everything was the same except for the price was marked down a little more. So I don't know, to me that doesn't look good and for that reason I will never shop at the Real Real again because I don't feel like they're, they're definitely doing something wrong. It's really strange that either they didn't see what was going on with the shoes or they tried to relist it and fix it in a, like, in a shady way, but not really fixing it and tried to relist it. So I thought that was pretty messed up. I don't know if it's just shoes in particular because I don't really, I've never bought shoes for myself on the Real Real. I've actually only had good experiences in the past. I've bought handbags. Um, and a few other things, but never really shoes. So I was pretty shocked. I don't know if, like, it's related to their shoe department 
or what, but I thought it was pretty serious. And then I thought to myself, maybe, maybe they're not looking at things thoroughly, or maybe they're doing shady things like fixing the shoes to look presentable enough to sell, but then they might fall apart shortly afterwards. I don't know. That's what it appeared to happen to me. So I didn't think it was okay that that had happened. And for that reason, I will no longer shop at the Real Real. It's very disappointing for me because I really love the Real Real from my previous experiences, but I just don't feel like they're, when they check the items, it doesn't seem like something's done. The things aren't done. When, when they check the items, it doesn't seem like it's done properly, which I think is a big deal for me. And I think maybe the, it's because the Real Real is very large compared to other consignment stores, but that's not an excuse. So yeah, that is my stance on it. I want to know if this has ever happened to other people and um, what are your thoughts on all of this? So yeah, I was pretty blown away by what happened to me and I thought that it's worth sharing to anyone who wants to sh um, shop at the Real Real because this is serious. They can't sell items that are broken or things that they don't thoroughly check. So yeah, this is not a really happy video, but I figured it's worth sharing. So thank you for hearing my story and um, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.